Hey. What's up, girl? What are we doing? And this is We're just all... going through all Jeff's stuff. I, I need to see what he actually owns. So we have a whole button, throttle tube, just in case, whole drivetrain, uh, grip, grip, tire. Just, just one. And tire changing stuff. I haven't had to glue a grip in so long because I've been doing ODI lock ons forever. Well, when you're like me and you were on the premium pillow tops. This is psychotic. You are the only professional racer that uses pillow tops. Pro Taper stoked. Cool. They're like, Times have changed. Yo, you want pillow tops? Hell yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah dude, we can't get them. Organized by moto. Yeah. Extra gear. Really? Yeah, extra gear. This guy's a so I have like a one full set of gear in here, one full set in here, one full set in here. So when I go out for practice, I just are grab Are you doing a different helmet every time too? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Three helmets. So I, have, I don't have to wash a helmet. I have, Do you have so, multiple hats off devices too? Yeah. Oh my god. One in each one. This guy. <laughs> this guy. And then this is like tubes, gloves. So you do run Nginx. Extra stuff. Yeah. yeah. Fuck. I run Nginx. Okay. This is the wash bucket. Mm. Um, if you want like it. could use a wash. <laughs> they never ask how the wash bucket is doing. They just oh, wait, ask where the wash bucket is. bring an extra one. See? Let's go. This guy is a top tier pro. Dang, dude. Just, just the Dang, graphic dude. match. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. It's all right. That Looks might be great. from last year, but it'll work. With the depth stuff, it doesn't matter. It's good all the time. <laughs> Shameless plug. There's my depth plug for the video. Let's there it go. is. I'm excited Ooh. to try this start button because really it seems good. like it's going to make my life really no, easy. It is, dude. Like in practice starts, I can reach down and twist it as I'm coming in, and then I just go boop. You should have really? seen it last uh, weekend. Oh, I slammed into Shimoda. Shimoda, no, Shimoda slammed into you. Well, the weekend before, all right, so I was rolling in behind Shimoda, and I reached down to twist mine right as Shimoda was stopping to. So I was like this and slammed him. He looked back and he was like, oh, sorry, dude. He thought it was his fault. So on the next weekend, That's I accidentally did it to him. <laughs> he apologized to me after I ran into him. I was like, yeah, no worries, dude. Don't do whatever again, though. <laughs> don't don't uh, ever get near me, okay? <laughs> oh. no, it's just... Yeah, baby. She's looking good. Yeah. So we got Left Coast Blueprints, Drafting Engineering is title sponsor for title the week. sponsor for the weekend. Let's go. Man, it looks great with the, you know, that navy blue. It looks it fantastic. Perfect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Yeah, I think it's my favorite. Get your blueprints from here, boys. Yeah. Is that the whoop monster? What? Jeff, what's going on yeah. out there? I'm a little scared. He's spooky. He's got the ghillie suit on and everything. Look at him. We got a fill-in mechanic guy, Connor Ailey. Hey, Connor. One of my great buddies from up here in Minnesota. He volunteered to help us out. He is pristine, Top doing a fantastic yeah. job. He checked over every bolt, made sure everything is ready to rip. So I'm feeling extra confident in the bike today. Mm -hmm. uh, we finally set the sag, which is huge, because it huge. was way off. <laughs> <laughs> but we're hoping that gets us a couple of extra, extra positions in qualifying. Also kind of interesting today, they flip-flopped the schedule. Yeah. So uh, all year and all last year, 250s went first. The qualifying schedule is 250B, 250A, 450A, 450B. So I was always the 250A group, which went second. Mm -hmm. and just depending on how the track is prepped and stuff, that can yeah. kind of can kind of shaft you um, if the B group gets a really good track. But this weekend, uh, they flip flop 250 and 450. So we will be the third practice, but 250B will go after us. So it's a, an extra little confidence booster knowing that we'll actually have the good track this weekend. Because um, we just walked out there to the Sandwoods. Oh, track looks beautiful. Oh my God. It's a freeway. It looks beautiful. So it's a freeway. I'm extra hyped for today. Um, yeah, it's going to be a good day, man. The season has been going great. You guys have been giving a lot of good feedback. Yes. It always makes me pumped when you guys are pumped about how the season is going. So I'm glad that things are going well this year. And uh, we're going to keep that ball rolling. Yeah. Try and get some points, baby. That's yeah. what we're here for. That's what we're here for. Exactly. I want so that's that what we're number. I want that two today. digit. <laughs> we're trying, dude. We're trying. Yeah. There he is. Free payments. Oh. What are these? Oh. You get some new freshies? Just new boot goofing, just you goofing. know. I'm just goofing. <laughs> oh. Alright, Nikki. See you up there, baby. Bye. Bye. Well, the Lars brothers are going to try to pull the whole shot to 18, but it's going to be Maximus Molin. Maximus Molin is going to be the Lars Colorado.
call, got a couple clicks of adjustments, and said, hey, 214 is nice, but it's not fast enough. Let's do a couple clicks. How's it going? Track is uh... They look greasy. It's pretty gnarly, yeah. They didn't till it super deep, but yep. this place has a really hard base. So okay. they tilled like maybe this much, yep. and then watered it really bad. Yeah. So it's like... It looked super slick. The top like four inches are sloppy, sketchy, like slick. So I don't know, I didn't feel super comfortable that time. Yeah. And on like my best heater lap, I had a little tip over in one of the corners. Yeah. Just lost the front end. You, so. Yeah, well it looked like your back end kind of kicked out. And yeah, like, like my front end pushed through the rut. Yeah. And then it caught and I thought I was saving it, but then the back end went Split. straight through yeah. the rut too. Yeah. And that was, um, the last lap was definitely my fastest though, I think. Yeah. I had a couple yeah. mistakes on that one heater I did in the middle, and then that last lap I felt it was pretty good. I almost feel like second sessions might be faster just because it's going to dry up a little bit. Yeah. So we'll see. But the yeah. whoops weren't bad. No. There was no way I was hitting that uphill triple in the yeah. middle. I mean, most people weren't. Yeah. We'll check timing in a little bit, and um, we'll let you guys know before uh, second practice. I don't even need to do the vlog anymore. Nikki's got it. <laughs> yeah. We got Connor. Connor's got the bike all with the whip. Unified. Yeah. He's barking orders. We got a good team going. Kellen's hanging out. We're ready to go. I'm gonna go take a walk because it is kind of a walk. Yeah. All right, I think get I want to. Where do you want me to be? Where do you like? Because like. You're, you're content.
slowly but surely okay. here. Cool. I don't know. We went two point something faster. So yeah. I did a 220 point like three or something like that, mm -hmm. which I mean, it's so hard to say. It all just depends on how this B group goes. Yeah. Cause like there were a bunch of dudes that I am now ahead of, yeah. but they now they're going time. out on the yeah. track too. So we just won't know until they're done. But in the meantime, we'll stay geared up just in yeah, case, yeah. you know. I think we were 28th in the A group, yeah. so it just depends on that B group. Yeah. We'll see. All right, Jeff, we just got the time to We're in. 36 by 0 .002 seconds. Normally, it's the other way around. I'm out by like less than a tenth of a second. Yeah. So, yeah. We're stoked on that. We are fired up in the pits right now. That's that part of the day between second practice and when the combined times post yeah. is like my least part or my least favorite part of a pro national yeah. by far. It honestly is like sick to your stomach. Dude. Yeah. Like we just sat here, Kellen, you just experienced it for the first time. We just sat here for like five minutes trying to get the times to load and we yeah. knew we were gonna be close. Yeah. And at the track that has the worst service, you're just like Yeah. We've been through plenty of LCQs this year. I've had my fair share. I'm not doing another one, all We're right? We're not doing it. All right. Cool. Connor, you happy? Never. What time is it? 11. It's got 10 minutes for the LCQ. 10? Yeah. Paul, you happy? I'm going to go with that one. Now. My good <laughs> I remember the first half I did, I was like... Oh. Oh. You like the hat hair? Oh, boy. Jeff, you need to put a hat on real quick. All right. Chest pro on now. All right, Jeff, we are 20 minutes out from first call. We're on time. We're, We're ahead of time, which Connor, has never happens. Connor keeps things in line. Yeah. He's got his whip out, and he's like... Look at him. We only have an hour till first call. You better get that gear on. Dang, it looks fresh. It's go time. You ready? Ready as I'll ever be. Yep. Heck yeah. Yes, sir. All right, man. I will see you in about 45 minutes. Enjoy Good luck. Enjoy your walk. Enjoy the battle. I want to see you fighting whole time. We'll fight, baby. We'll fight.
I knew something was wrong because it was like probably 10 or 12 minutes in he started fading hard I was like uh oh um, I didn't think of it any like you know how you said it was really cold last night or something so it was like I just felt like I had to puke like at maybe 10 or 15 yeah definitely not good yeah I don't know every other race I was like <laughs> I could push hard to the last lap yeah, and it just looked like, yeah, like 12 minutes in, you looked like something was wrong. Well, like I had okay speed for a little bit. I passed some people. Yeah, you had, like, there was a group that you were battling with, and I thought, I was like, heck yeah, like, you're gonna... We unloaded, like, a gallon of diarrhea in the Conquest, so, <laughs> sorry. R.I.P. Sorry, Paul. We're definitely gonna have to empty those holding, holding tanks ASAP. R.I.P. Holding tanks. On the bright side, I think I dropped about 10 pounds, so suspension is gonna be feeling tiled, dude. <laughs> <laughs> so what's the goal for this next moto? Goal yeah. is to ride like a rape date the first three laps. Yep. And uh, try to try to finish if we can. Yeah. Well, like Connor was saying, actually Connor can take it away. He's gonna get tired anyways because he's clearly sick. So the plan is to go as fast as we can early and fall off late anyways. Yep. Right? Yeah. Makes sense. To no me. point in going and rolling around since lap one. If we're thirty second, we're thirty second. Might as well try to run twenty something for a little while. Yeah. So. He's fast enough to do it, he's just gonna feel good enough to do it. Definitely, yep. definitely not feeling that hot right now. No. Get it good. Still looks real good. Rip it. Give me three hardest laps you can do. We'll do it.
were ripping. I'd say mission accomplished, but now I'm just pissed or bummed, sorry, that I couldn't finish because I felt incredible. Yeah. Came around the first turn like 38. And then like, first lap, you're like mid 20s. Up to 22nd at one yeah. point. I was glad you didn't get tangled up with all the guys in uh, the before the finish. Yeah, that was rough. I caught it all on camera. Dude, I'm just mad because if I had like red bud level energy, that could have been a points moto just because of all like how many factory dudes crashed, you know? Yeah. Did you just like start blacking out kind of thing or? I threw up in the bathroom as soon as I pulled off. Yeah. I heard the announcer go, oh, Jeff Walker pulling off track. I was like, oh, fuck. You know, like, dude, he's done. I about, first off, I about crapped my pants. Yeah. <laughs> I was going to the bathroom to take a dump, and then I threw up, and then I felt good. I almost got back on. Yeah. And then it was like, when I took that first sip of water, that ruined me. Like, my stomach just went so bad after that. Ugh. You needed it, though. Yeah, no, I did, but. I mean, you, you gave up so much of your hydration. Uh, Mid, -mo like, uh, in between. In the yeah. conquest. Yeah. All right, Nikki. Start this wrap up off. All right, so. Second mode didn't go too well. Um, I wasn't kitted up when Jeff pulled off. I was ready to sub in. It could have been great. I mean, all I had to do was ride around. I think I could have done that. For sure. Well, Connor, you did, you far exceeded all expectations and obviously we're the MVP of the day. Nothing Bike broke. Was, nothing broke. Bike was cleaner than like the day I brought it off the showroom floor every single time I rode it. So that was dope. So thank you very much. It's good, it's easy. KTMs are great machines. They're easy to work on. The big race tech logo? Yeah. Dude, you were on point. A Star's hat? Thanks, checkers. I'm here. You can prepare, baby. It was a good weekend. Your riding was really good outside of being sick. I mean, I yeah. think I think if you were healthy, that, would, that was going to be close to points. Jeff's first three laps, the second moto, were just whipped. Yeah. Overall, I mean, not a perfect day, but they don't always go perfectly. The main thing is, you know, we can take some positives away from it. One, no LCQ. That is always incredible. Two, Nikki Z looked fantastic all day. Hello. He had the biggest turkey leg I've ever seen. Yep. Look at those shorts. <laughs> oh my word. Beautiful. Um, but yeah, first moto was a wash. I'm just going to forget about that one. Um, nothing too positive to take away from it. But moto two came out like a cannon. I think we came around the first corner 38th, and uh, by the second lap, we were like 22nd. So, I mean, there's definitely positives to take away from it. Not the best weekend of all time, but you got to just focus on the positives. What are you gonna do? Not a perfect weekend, but... We're healthy, we're safe, we're not broken. That's right. Just had some minor issues. Just a, uh, yeah, just a little diarrhea, you know? If that's all that goes wrong, I'll take it. Man, all right, close it out, Nikki. Close it out. All right, guys, good seeing you. Thanks for tuning in. We'll catch you next time. Peace. Peace. I like your style. Put you in Chanel, cause it's just perfect for your smile. Girl, I swear for you, I run the world, I run the mile.